Onwards and upwards, eh? Yeah. Guess so. so it's day one of bass open season for the wild creeks in Queensland, and we're back. All three of us are out today. We're going to try and get some little skinny water bass. So yeah. Yeah, that's essentially it. It's a bit low, hasn't had enough rain. I think we had nine mils two days ago, mm. and that's been about it for the last like three weeks. So, <laughs> um, if you see us casting at some pretty festy looking water, well, <laughs> we'll just blame that on no rain. Yeah, it would have been nice to have a bit of a flush out, but hopefully the fish are still here and we can find a couple. But Hopefully it doesn't look like that. That, yeah. The whole way. But if it does, who knows? Alas. <laughs> We'll be trudging through some fun stuff in a couple minutes, but uh, yeah, we'll hopefully get some. I go my glasses or not? I won't for now, I don't think. Um. Hi. Can't wait for a goanna to come get me. <laughs> I'm not worried about goannas. I'm worried about the other little creepy crawlies. Snakes. Centipedes. Oh yeah. Ticks. <laughs> no, I definitely got a bite. The shallow part. That's the deep part. Yeah. Type thing. I'm gonna try and get one up on that log. Yeah, good idea. See, I, I put my sunnies on. It's, it's bright. Oh, I take them off. It's too bright. Put them back on. It just feels almost too dark. Mm. Yeah, you're right, it is too dark with the sunnies now. <laughs> you yeah. can't decide what it wants to do, hey? Switching between them. No fish yet, but it's early days. The better pools are still up this way. I haven't gotten too wet yet. <laughs> Speak for yourself. Mate, I've got the tide mark up here. True, yeah, you went a bit deeper than me. I might just drop in. Yeah. It gets a bit deep here. Yeah? Yeah. From what I, yeah, definitely does. Ooh wee. There is life. Yeah? I've seen something warm. Mm. That's suspiciously warm. That Ooh. stick, that was. Slippery slope is found. Yeah. Yeah, that was expected. Oh! Yes! Here, tighten, tighten, tighten. Yep, good. Keep going. Oh, he's got you. He's just there. Oh, oh I got him. Nice, nice. Oh. Bring him up. It's alright, he's looked okay. Oh, you little turd. Nice, man. <laughs> See. <laughs> Came off the worst cast I've done all day. <laughs> I've done it. I got a bass on a fly. Crazy little, little eat. Yeah, ate it in a really bad uh, bad cast from me actually. But that's how they normally come. It's never on your best ones. It's always on your worst. So you gotta fish all of them. But yeah, no, it was awesome. Um, first bass on fly. Um, what, the fly? Uh, I think it's just an EJ Todd. It'd be just a deer hair stacked in a ball with a little piece of skin out the back. He's not very big, but he looks pretty fierce. Healthy. Uh, and that was, yeah, using my five weight. I'm not tangled. I'm not tangled. No, good, Let's go, baby. Um, am I just popping them off? Okay, so I'm just gonna rest them here pop the hook out and then put them back into this little um, septic tank. Oh, look at, oh, anyway. Oh, there we go. Sweet. Camera on? Yeah. Uh, this will be here. It is now. It'll record my three meter fall into the creek. Yeah. I'm here to watch. We're just finding a way to get over the other side of the creek, which is, we're thinking is going to be this big old tree. Yeah, it does look a bit precarious, but we've used this tree to cross a few times. It's washed away a little bit since the last time we were here, but we'll give it a crack. Let's fish this, eh? Let, let's fish this properly, because this actually looks really good. Don't champ me. Oh. <laughs> oh, yes, wind, wind. This. Mate, you're going for a swim. What with the mic on? No, uh, it won't be that deep. It's one for one, I retrieve his fly. 
He retrieves my lure. How good. Yes! We finally got it. That wasn't too hard. Sometimes you just got to do it yourself, eh? It's hard to get good help. The plan today is we walk in this little skinny creek. Um, as you can see, it's, you know, maybe five, ten metres max width. Lots of lay down snags, heaps of timber, which I managed to find almost every cast. I'm throwing a little Daiwa Bait Junkie Grub. Um, it's one of the 2.5s. It's in sprayed grass colour. And it's on a 1 30th Bait Junkie Jig Head. Um, Alex is about to tie on a little surface rat fly because um, we've seen fish in here and we've caught them on surface in the past. He's going to be throwing surface. I'm going to be targeting the lower parts of the water column. Um, yeah, so we're just trying to get it as close to the structure as possible and hope that a little bass comes out and grabs it. Yeah. Yes, I'm on fly. We've got Mousy Boy. A little ratty. Um, and I was throwing a... What do you call that? Self-tied leech? It's a, like a leechy, it's got a bit of rabbit tail and a bit of a cover. Sinks a little bit. Limited edition, stick. Limited edition, sticks flies. Yep. But um, no, we're going surface now because get a bit of their attention and hopefully they go. Yep, climb on. But he's running a Cortland five weight fly combo. Um, that's it there. It's a nice, shorter little fly stick that'll help him get some casts in in the tight stuff. And I've got my Daiwa in feet with the 2000 Revelry. So nice, super light combos, and hopefully we can find a few that'll be keen. Okay. I reckon try up there. Oh, okay. What do you reckon? Just plonk one in the middle, you've got plenty of room for a back cast. Yeah, plenty. grub I was using I'm thinking that they're having trouble finding it because um, this big slick on the water it's a bit gross so I'm gonna go for something a little bit more um, something that creates a little bit more disturbance which is in this case a Z-Man finesse frog and a little unweighted worm hook so I'm gonna hopefully burn this across the surface and who knows they might find it a little bit easier than the grub which is very finesse so see if we can put it in front of a few. I think the trick is not to do big pulls just little tiny like Slide it almost. Come on. How can you go slower? Yeah. Well. You can maybe put your rod tip up top. It's probably a bit more you friendly. Hello. Just having a little sit down break while I fish this pool. After all, why would you want to stand up when you can sit down and fish? Pretty good. Any close to the water for skimming? Oh, that got that got me. It's deep. It's deep. <laughs> <laughs> and it doesn't get shallower. <laughs> well, I'm committed now. Oh, that side's <laughs> real deep. I'm not going that way. <laughs> oh no. I don't know if you'll. I don't know if you'll be happy with any of them. <laughs> oh, that's really cold. There's a, there's a stump there. You can. Yeah, get I feel up that. On. Oh, what am I standing on? <gasps> <laughs> Get further, there's another. Yeah. Oh. oh. I can't believe that one ate it off such a bad cast. Oh, dude. I lived it, flopped it down. I was like, oh. <laughs> Alright, onwards. The clinical term, teabagging. Yes. You know, like. It's just a frog that's just really struggling to get out of the water. You just imagine this, your like he's, he's doing a little hoppy down there. He's in distress, and a little bass is going to come up and eat him. <laughs> ah, ah, no, don't eat me, bass, please. <laughs> ah. And he's free. Oh. Yep. Woo! 
Woo-hoo! How good's that, eh? He'd only be all of about ooh, 15 centimetres. <laughs> He's a monster, Alex. Look at him. Can't let me hit the frog. He smashed the frog, though, eh? Comparatively, the frog's like, what? You know, pretty big bait for the size of the fish. But we won't keep him out too long because he's a nice, healthy little dude, so we'll let him go. So we're wrapping up our little bass mission. Um, we're losing light a bit, so it's time to start calling quits and making for home. Yeah, we've still got a couple of K to walk back to the car. Um, it was really nice to crack a bass, though. Yeah. Alex got a nice, healthy one, so I'm very First one very on fly, so I'm very happy. Can't ask um, for much more, really. <laughs> yeah. It's pretty cool. Yeah, even though if it was off a bad cast, but you win. Winners win, hey. Mm, yeah. Um, so, <laughs> yeah, so hope you guys all enjoyed our videos and we'll be getting into a lot of bass this year, hopefully, so. Mm. Yep, I'm keen for the season. It's yeah, gonna good. it's gonna be a good one. All right, cheers.